Charlotte has plenty of creeks and waterways, and while they are pretty, they're also very, very important. Understanding more about our connection to our creeks, our effect on them, and our dependence on them is key to helping improve them. Kristen O'Reilly with Charlotte Mecklenburg Storm Water Services is here with us this morning. Kristen, welcome to Charlotte today. Thank you. Uh, this is an important topic, but you're also making it fun and educational too. How so? Absolutely. Well, we have partnered with a really neat project called Keeping Watch on Water. It's a project uh, through UNCC College of Arts and Architecture and the Urban Institute, and they're doing a variety of events across the city to make it fun, to learn about our water and engage about our water and hopefully protect it. What are actually some of the things they're doing? Uh, they just opened up this last Friday with the kickoff event at the UNCC, UNCC City Center where there's an art exhibit of photography. There's a wall of water of samples that volunteers have brought in from all over the county. Mm -hmm. There's a huge 3D watershed map wow. that's been created. Um, and events will continue from now until July 1st. And so there'll be dirty martini events and film debuts about water. There will be creek walks, nature walks. There'll be cleanups. There'll be, um, you know, there'll be uh, photojournalists. There'll be articles in the newspaper. This does seem like fun. It's really, it, yeah, it's, it is. it's coming at it from a variety of angles. It's really cool. All right, what is the Passage of Rain project? That is one of my favorite because I'm involved, obviously. <laughs> um, but Stormwater Services, you know, we jumped on board with this whole project because we want to highlight creeks as well. We're mm -hmm. all about creeks and protecting them. And so what we did is we joined forces and we painted sidewalks. We marked the open channel of creeks with colorful stakes, a whole variety of ways we used um, to highlight our creeks. And hopefully that will help people understand the street to stream connection mm -hmm. where rain lands on the street. That's our urban streams and it goes underground underneath all of us. And there's a whole system of pipes that then takes it to our creeks. Mm -hmm. That was the whole point of the project. Well, those are things that most of us, I think, to be honest, we, we take for granted. We don't think about that stuff. Out of sight, out of mind. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Um, why is it important to you, Kristen, that the community cares and gets involved in this in some way? Well, Charlotte and every city throughout the nation has a system of creeks throughout it. And that system can either be an asset for the community and help our quality of life, or it can be a threat to public health. So if we've got polluted water, that's a problem. But if we have healthy water, it can actually be really great for kids to play in, greenways, recreation, leads to our drinking water. So it's really important that we all know it's there and help protect it. Is there a sign up for it? I mean, how do you get involved? Keepingwatch.org is a great way to learn about all the events, or you can go to our website, which is stormwater.charmec.org. Again, stormwater org. The address website is there on your screen. Uh, Kristen, thank you so much for being here today. We appreciate thank your you. time this morning. Thank you so much. I thought you were going to grab. Uh, I was. <laughs> well, I was going to show you how we, you know, clean up the streams. <laughs> I was going to grab you over here. Just but, grab, um, I told her I'd give her $5 if she went <laughs> to you. Thank you. Yeah, thank thank you. you. Thank you.